My name is Karen Austin Brave Crow. I'm Hunk Papa Lakota from the Standing Rock Nation in Fort Yates, North Dakota. I was taken off the reservation at the age of three because I was left out in a severe blizzard and got um, severe frostbite on both of my hands and they were frozen solid in fist form. From the ages of three to six, um, I was in countless foster homes. At the age of six, I got adopted into a white family and I stayed with them for a few years. Uh, me and my dad on Sunday had an argument and I told him I wished he would die. And on Monday, he died. So that threw me into running all over the United States. I ran and I ran and I ran. I blamed myself for my dad's death. And um, from the ages of 12 to 29, I experienced several abductions. I've been raped, I've been robbed. I was kidnapped at the age of 15 and beat for months. Someone did help me ask Jesus into my heart at age 18, but I didn't understand it and went my own way. So I, then I became an alcoholic and a drug addict and cocaine was my favorite drug. Finally, that lifestyle was killing me. I was dying from drugs and alcohol. And I, I would go, I would collapse about once or twice a week and they'd have to take me into the ambulance to the hospital. One night I was in my apartment and I put a Christian radio station on and I heard God's voice. And I heard God say to me, my child, it's time to come back. It's time to come back, my child. And I remember just going, oh my God, that is God's voice. And he's telling me to come back in the condition I was in, full of drugs and alcohol and cigarettes and the lifestyle that I was living. Jesus, in one day, set me free instantly from drugs, alcohol, and cigarettes and the whole lifestyle. In one day, Jesus set me free. And now I get the privilege of singing my testimony in song called It's Time to Come Back.